Hi everyone, Aaron here for Zolotech and iOS 12 beta 2 has been out for a few days now. I've been using it on my iPhone 10 and for me it has been less than great. It's actually been pretty buggy. If you saw the beginning of this video, you saw this respringing and that was right before I began recording this video. I actually went into music, I was listening to a song, I swiped out to go back home and it immediately resprung. Now this has been happening to me at least one to two times a day, sometimes three. So I've had it happen in music, messages, weather, and some other random apps as well. I don't know that it's specific to the apps, but it is happening on this quite often. And I've actually found that I have to reboot this one to two times a day as well for it to actually operate properly. Now I didn't have that issue with iOS 12 beta one. So this one has been worse for me in every way except for the battery. So if you go into settings, we take a look at the battery. Now I have been fairly busy, so I haven't been using it as much as I normally do. Although screen on time says it's longer. So three hours and 32 minutes screen on, one hour 24 screen off. If we go into show battery usage, you'll see we can go and drill down here. We can go to the last 10 days and you'll see you'll see that the battery uh, has a lot of screen off time as well, but either way you get the idea. Here's my usage, recently deleted apps, why that's taking an hour and a half of, of usage, I have no idea, but Twitter, home and lock screen, YouTube, three hours and two minutes, that's over over 10 days or a few days anyway. And this particular usage is what's been going on now. So this particular beta has not been great. Like I said, it's been crashing for me over and over. Some people have said that their camera doesn't work in beta two. It won't open. They can't use it. And other people have been having bugs as well. However, that doesn't mean that it's going to be awful going forward. That's just the life of using early betas. Now, for those of you that are waiting for the public beta, I would expect that somewhere next week because Apple said it would be out before the end of this month. So Monday or Tuesday, we probably will see beta three along with the public beta one. Maybe we'll just see public beta one, but usually they'll push out the third one. That's typically what they do with the exception of, I think, last year where it was beta two and the same, if I remember correctly. So I would expect it next week. So if you want to watch these updates and continue to get these updates, make sure to subscribe because a lot of people may be seeing this in their feed, but they may not be subscribed. You don't have to get notifications for every one of the updates, but I just want to make sure that if you're interested, make sure to do that. And notifications can be adjusted for either every video or just some videos. So that's it for this particular beta. Let me know your experience in the comments below. I'll leave a link to this wallpaper in the description below as well. As always, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time.